Hey there, Doug Celine, your digital photo guru here. Today I'm going to show you how to create a transparent logo sticker for Instagram in Photoshop. If you're new to the channel, please subscribe and click the bell icon to be notified when I upload new videos. Leave a like and leave comments. Watch the video all the way to the end and I'll show you a real cool Instagram tip. Social media is all about consistency. Lately, I've been using Instagram to draw visitors to my YouTube channel. On my YouTube channel, I have a specific background in my header and I have a font that I use. And I'm going to replicate this on my Instagram stories and I'm going to do this in Photoshop. In Photoshop, I've created a document 1080 pixels by 1920 pixels, which is the size of an Instagram story. And I've put my background in this document. Now I'm going to save this as a ping file and upload this to my phone. Okay, and now that I've got that business out of the way, I'm going to select my text tool and I'm going to select the horizontal type tool. The font I use on my watermark is Anthony Signature. And that's what I'm going to use for my Instagram sticker. So I just type my name. I'm going to center it in the document. And on YouTube, I go by Digital Photo Guru. So I'm going to put that underneath, and the font I use is Oswald. And it's semi-bold. I like to use small caps on my logo. So I'm just gonna select the text, open the character panel, and then click this icon to get small caps. Okay, that looks pretty good. So now I'm going to create a selection around my logo, and I'm going to crop the document. And the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to hide the background layer, and now I'm going to export this as a ping file with transparency. And I'm going to do an old export method on this. I'm going to choose File Export save for web legacy and this enables me to have transparency in the document now I'm going to save this to the desktop actually I need to save this as my logo and there I'm done and now let's go to my iPad and see how it all comes together in Instagram I uploaded the logo in the background to my iPad. I prefer working with the iPad when working with Instagram. It's got a slightly bigger screen and I've got a portable keyboard that I can use to add captions and hashtags and all that other good stuff. And okay, now here I am in Instagram and I've already got a story in Instagram. So what I'm going to do is tap the plus sign next to my avatar. And then I'm going to, first thing I'm going to do is get my background in the story. And then once I've got the background in the story, I need to scroll down through the stickers until I find the blank sticker that enables me to add my sticker to the document. And once I add the sticker to the document, it's beautifully transparent. I can resize it and position it anywhere I want. But there's another way to get photos into your Instagram stories. Go to your camera roll and select the photo that you want to add and then click copy and then it shows up when you go back in Instagram as a sticker and just click to add the sticker to your story and then you can finish it off by adding icons and share it with the world so there you have it creating a logo on a transparent background in Photoshop for use in Instagram